What's going on, everybody? Mr. Triad here with... Hey, what's up? It's Jawbreaker. What's good, man? What's up, man? I, I just want to start out and say congratulations on your channel, man. You are really taking off. Wow, dude, that was actually un unexpected. <laughs> like We normally like plan out what we're going to say and stuff, so... I just wanted to throw it out, you know? I think everybody appreciates the time and effort you put in your videos. So I think uh, I'll speak on behalf of all your subs that uh, you're making some good content, dude. Oh, dude, that's that's really nice of you, man. I'm kind of kind of blushing, I guess. I don't know. Thanks, man. <laughs> Do I have to give you the two keys now? Oh, that's right. Yeah. So, guys, I won Car Wars. <laughs> First off, thank you, thank you so much because I don't ever win anymore. Like I, I was winning a lot at the beginning, you know, and then for like the last, I mean, what are we on? Like twelve now? Yeah, eleven or twelve, I think. Yeah. Um. So yeah, like recently I've been losing all the time. So. Yeah, thank you for that. <laughs> and today, Jaw, I, I brought, I, uh, so let me put it this way. The last few car wars, I've tried very hard to like overkill it. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But originally I was winning when I was trying new things, I think, mm -hmm. right? Like, I think I was doing better when I just like, just try whatever came up, you know, and I was trying to be creative. Does that make sense? Versus trying to impress, right? Sure. Yeah. Okay. So I, and also like, I want to be like the people's champ, you know, I, I want to be Muhammad Ali. Okay. So I've actually made cars that are like the cheapest cars I've ever made on car wars today. Really? Yes. With this brand new Jaeger, Jaeger wow. car, dude, two of them are under 20 keys. One of them's under oh 20, one of them's under 10. I went the complete opposite. Oh, sh shoot. <laughs> <laughs> I almost just swore. <laughs> all right. All right. All right, guys, you know what? No more talking. Let's get into it. We'll be right back with car number one. All right. All right, John, man. Car number one, dude. Um, I I have no idea what you've done. Did you see my show uh, with the uh, freestyling with Pulse Stepsy I did? Yeah. Okay. So, you know, I had already made three acres. So I was real lazy in this one. I actually brought one of those cars in because it was just so good, man. Like, I had to use it. So apologize in advance yeah. for that. No but worries. I like it. Are you ready? Yeah, let's, uh, hold on. Let's, what are we going to wager here? Oh, oh, I don't know. Uh, what was, what did we talk about? We had something. We were, I think we're going to do a biomass to the community from the ah, loser. That's right. That's right. Yeah, yeah. So guys, now listen, you have to vote this time. Get on Twitter right now. You have to vote for the winner because whoever loses has to donate a biomass to the community. We'll do a giveaway on Twitter. Etc. Cetera, Etc. Cetera, Etc. Cetera. So you guys have to make sure to get on Twitter and vote because your decision decides whether it's Jawbreaker or I that gives away a biomass to one of you guys. That's pretty cool, right? Yeah, that sounds good. I think people would appreciate that. I think so too. Free man. black market decal. It's better than you or I getting uh, something. You know, yeah. I gotta give a, I gotta give a shout out to John Salmon and Phantom Ace because honestly, I just stole that from you guys. I thought it was really cool. Like they're doing it with the um, the blind trading stuff. I saw that so. Anyways, you ready, man? Yeah, let's do it. All right, three, two, one. So, yeah, okay, so you did bubbly. And, oh, that's so funny. Look at that, white zombies, man. Like, our cars are so mm -hmm. similar, aren't they? See, I didn't think you'd do white zombies because that was on your intro car. I thought you'd uh, avoid using your same same wheels. Well, this car was my favorite, personally, out of the three I put on the freestyle. But... Uh, Jawbreaker, you go ahead and go first, man. Tell us about your car, dude. Yeah, man. So we got the white Jaeger here. Uh, it's 35 keys. Uh, put the bubbly. I'm huh? sorry. I didn't even know you got a white Jaeger, dude. Yeah. Did didn't I tell you? It? Yeah, I bought okay. it. No, I bought okay. it. Yeah. Okay. I'm um, I'm boycotting the accelerator crate, but uh, we'll talk about that later. Oh, no. All right. Yeah. All right. And then I got the bubbly decal, 25 keys. If you didn't know this, the bubbly is actually the most expensive uh, black market decal right now. It's going up like crazy, and I have a theory why if you want to hear it. Yeah, what's up? Okay, so if you look at all the crates, the bubbly didn't come out to the nitro crate, right? Mm -hmm. The nitro crate was the last crate to have black market decals. Mm. So there's less of them, you think? There's way less of them because mm -hmm. it's only come out of nitro. It's never going to come out again. And I don't think bubbly, I mean, obviously, like, look at these two cars together. Like, this heat wave is way nicer than the bubbly, in my opinion, right? Yeah. But because there won't be any more bubblies ever again unless they bring it back in a pcc or something yeah. i think that's what's driving the price it's interesting I mean, it's a valid point i think um and that's actually one of the reasons why i'm boycotting the accelerator crate but i'm gonna come out with a video later this week uh with some of the some of the arguments for why i'm boycotting but 
just uh, keep it along with it. You got 185 for the white zombas. Um, that those prices are pretty steady. Uh, you know, they dropped down a couple weeks ago, but then they kind of stabilized. And mm -hmm. then for the boost, I just went with. I gotta find the garage. I can't find the garage with the new update. Magic missile, titanium white magic missile. That mm -hmm. is four keys overall. 249 keys for this setup, and then for the orange car, I just went with a dark red with uh, with a black uh, uh, secondary color. That looks good, man. That dark that dark red, I really like that. That's sexy, man. That looks I think, good. I think that white pops a lot. All right, hold on. I'm gonna get my prices up here. Um, so Jawbreaker, I hate to break it to you, but your prices are a tad bit old. The white zombies are actually 190 to 200 now, <laughs> by the way. I just looked at it, really? <laughs> no, dude, yeah, you gotta refresh. You have to you have to remember to refresh the uh, spreadsheet. Oh, uh, you're right. You are right, 190. Okay, well, so Jaw, we went with very, very similar cars, okay? This is the most expensive car I've made in this series. This is also the White Jaeger, which I think is super nice, guys. Again, I made a video about that earlier with uh, Paul Stepsy. Um, it, that's 35 to 40 keys. I paid 75 for it, but it was on day one. So I paid a ton more money for it, but I just, I thought it was awesome. So I wanted to get it. Um, the heat wave is 20 to 21. Actually, let me go ahead and get into here. So you see the heat wave here. Um, here's the colors I chose. So originally I had done like this, the sky blue with the lighter blue. So it was like this really dreamy look to it. But during that video, I actually wanted to show him the lines of the heat wave and jawbreaker. This was something that you pointed out to me, right? Is how good the lines look on the heat wave. The heat so, wave. I mean, on the Jaeger, I think is the best looking car for the heat oh, wave. Oh yeah. By it's far. So nice. Mm -hmm. And so I went during the video, I actually swapped, swapped it to this dark gray color. And it, to me, it just is so visually appealing. Like the lines are perfect. It has this awesome fiery contrast to it. I, I just love it, okay? Um, for the wheels, obviously, again, White Zamba is 190 to 200. Uh, last but not least, I put the white hex phase. Um, it's just slightly different style than what I normally do, but I think it works with this car. And the fact that it's titanium white goes really well with the wheels. It's a very, very bright boost, as you can see. Um, all in all, I think it ties in very well. So the entire car is 248 keys. I think that's like a key more than yours. Is that what you said? Uh, I said 249, but I had my okay. prices wrong. Uh, so that would have been 254 for mine. Okay, so six keys or so less. Okay, yeah, okay. Well, anyways, guys, so that's car number one. And make remember, get on Twitter right away. Go vote and tell us which car you like better because the loser will be giving you guys a biomass in the very near future. So your vote matters more now than ever. We'll be right back with car number two. All right, John, car number two. It, you know, to be to be fair, guys, I forgot to show you the red, uh, the orange car here, which is actually pink. I, I was going for like this really bright color with the sky blue and the pink, you know, to kind of make it pop across the field. So that's the color I chose here. But I wanted to show you so that uh, you saw both the Jaws colors and see both of mine. Uh, anyways, John, you ready for car number two? Yeah, man, I, uh, I'm gonna set a record here for the most expensive car in Car Wars. Really, like, did you go back and confirm? Yeah, I think uh, it's going to be 100% more expensive than any car we've seen. Oh, wow. So it sounds like alpha items then. Possibly. <laughs> all right, all right. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one. Ah, the wheels. I was right. Okay, yeah. you got your Goldstone wheels. This is This jawbreaker is a really interesting battle. You, you're you're really breaking, you think yes. so oh yes because you're breaking the record for price yeah i'm at the exact opposite end really yeah this car's uh 14 keys well, why don't you tell us about it yeah sure all right so let's get into it completely unpainted jaeger okay um because i only ha i have a third one a pink one but i was letting my wife use that so i only use the white one and then an unpainted jaeger on the next two cars um, so, but what I was going for here is the Jaeger is just such a beautiful race car looking car. And if you, uh, watch Le Mans racing, it's very similar body to a Le Mans race car. Um, so that's what this is. It's called the Le Mans racer. Um, the Jaeger is 3.5 to 4.5. I have the circuit pro, uh, decal, which comes with the car. Okay. 
And what I was going for here was like this real clean stock uh, look like you would see like on a showroom floor or like in a race pit before a race starts. So I went with the tune gloss. Now that's a DLC um, gloss, but I don't know which DLC. So I guess I should have added like $2 onto, onto it for that. So maybe it'd be 16.5 to be more accurate. Um, but here's one thing to point out. So with my secondary color, you see, I actually went with a dark blue. Joe, you have to look really close. It's not black for my secondary. Oh, it's yeah. actually a, a dark blue on that mm -hmm. um, because I think it goes really well with the green. Now, whereas on the red, I actually went with a dark red because I tried doing some other colors. I just didn't like the, the contrast. So I think with the red, this just works better. Um, and then obviously for the wheels, uh, black Dietschy, which is a very common wheel for pros. And it kind of goes with the whole theme of just like a race car because they look like real rims, right? Mm -hmm. Now for the boost, I kind of struggled with it because I was trying to go for like this more realistic car. So what I did is I used the black ion, which as you guys know, is, is basically almost unseeable, right? Like there's just a couple lines that are like this really light gray. Like if you go to the back of the car, you can barely see it at all. Um, to kind of, again, keep that effect going on uh, throughout the theme of the car, which is to be like a, a real race car. So uh, the Black Ions 4 to 5, the Black Dietschy 7 to 10, Circuit Pros free. If you count the Tune Gloss, which is probably like $2 for whichever DLC it is, and the Jaeger at 3.5 to 4.5, it's 14.5 keys total for this entire car. <laughs> Not bad. Not bad. <laughs> all right, all right. I, I see where this is going, Josh. Yeah, I see what I mean, you're doing here, man. All I, right, go ahead. Well, Throw me under the bus. Go well, ahead. first I'm going to say this is my baby. This, the Jaeger car is like one of the best looking cars, one of the best handling cars yes. ever. And it booms. Exactly. It booms so hard. It's I love so, this car. Yeah, the hitbox is perfect. The I mean, everything about this car is perfect. And then to throw my Alpha Goldstones on here. I mean, I, I mean, I don't think you can find, and it, I'm going to be a little, uh, I don't know, like, this is the car. I mean, how do you beat this car? And you think your car is going to beat this? I, All right. I, I, well, I don't think, so not only are you setting the record for price, but the record <laughs> for smack talk, yeah. I think, right now. <laughs> so, uh, I don't know if you can tell or not, this is actually a Black Jaeger. Uh, right now at nine keys, and I'm assuming you got the regular Jaeger, so I don't know yeah, if, if you like look. No I mean, you can barely tell any difference, but there's nine keys. Uh, the Stripes decal, it's a free decal that comes with the Jaeger car. The Goldstones, Alpha Reward Goldstones, these are 1,200 keys right now. The mm -hmm. For the boost, you know, I didn't have really any good boost to go with this. I still plan on getting the um gold alpha rush boost. yeah the yeah. alpha gold rush boost but mm -hmm. uh it's a little pricey right now but eventually i'm probably going to get that so i just went with the standard helios which is the fan rewards R rlcs fan rewards and mm -hmm. uh you know it's got a nice glow yellow glow to it that kind of matches the the overall theme of the car and then for my blue car i just went with the standard blue uh dark blue just makes that uh, those gold stones and then the gold stripes really pop. Overall, yeah. twelve oh nine point five keys, twelve hundred nine <laughs> keys. That's ridiculous, man. <laughs> <laughs> so this it is interesting, and I think it's a valid argument. Okay, so your car is way more expensive. However, nobody like what one percent of the population of people that watch this can afford yeah, it. yeah there's gonna be very right. limited but i i want to throw it out there you know some people may have never seen the alpha wheels before sure i agree i have a question for you john your sure. uh paint your paint finish what is that because mine's tune gloss but i can't tell is yours a matte or yeah so my paint my base paint color is matte and then the stripe uh brush metallic brushed meta uh, metal brushed metal yeah okay so it kind of gives that sparkle you know kind of if you look at the stripe it kind of sparkles a little bit kind of like to, the gold stone to match wheels. the wheels exactly right. yep that's yeah, cool I, I can tell you put some thought into it man i like how we're both very like simple no black market decals right. you know it's more about accentuating the car than it is about the decal or anything else right mm -hmm. i like it dude all right, man. I don't know who's going to win this one. I, I'm kind of nervous because of the money on your car. We'll see. I'm really curious, guys. Remember, you got to go vote because you decide who wins that biomass. We'll be right back with car number three.
All right, guys, we're, we're back for the final car. I honestly, at this point, I have no clue. That's <laughs> like the worst part about taking risks, Ja, is like, I just don't know how people are going to react. I, I can't even guess it, you know, because like you do that all the time, like with these crazy cars that I would never expect to win, you know, <laughs> and then you pull out that W and I'm just like, that's impossible, you know, so I mean, I'm. I don't know. I think people like different and, um, you know, when you kind of go to the extreme and people see stuff that they haven't seen before, I you, think they yeah, really like it. Right? You learn. Yeah. You're used to a certain way. You try something extreme and then that's how you find those, those cool, unique things that you never knew. Exactly. You ready, man? Yeah. Final car. All right, man. Here we go. Three, two, one. That's not bad. I'm waiting for his reaction. <laughs> I wanted to hear what he thought. All right, go ahead. Go ahead, Jeff. I mean, You're up first, man. All right, I'll knock mine out. This is, uh, you know, one thing that we haven't done is a lot of green uh, on on the on the Car Wars show. So I, I figured I'd break out some green, and we haven't done a lot of 20XX. So I kind of went out on a limb and, and brought both of those out. This is a standard Jaeger, which is 3.5 keys, and then the 20XX right now is 23 keys. I threw the Lima Apex on there. Those are been those have been dropping in price, which I'm really surprised because surprised, they yeah. they glow so much. They you know, do. it's one of the yeah. them and the white Apex are the only ones that really glow and they're noticeable. So that's uh, 22 keys, and then for the boost, I went with a orange Neothermo, and. The reason I went with the orange Neothermo is it actually has orange and green in there. So and for my secondary color, I went with the orange car, orange setup, and the orange Apex. So overall, this is 50 keys even. So it's really interesting. When you put on the orange car, I saw it from the back, and I, I instantly fell in love with it. And I was turning, and then I saw the green and the red. And this is like the downfall of 20XX, right? Like you can't control that. Yeah, it seems like every color choice you make is yeah. something completely different. It's like the it's like it might, kind of reminds me of like the burnt sienna zambas. Like it could look so much nicer, <laughs> or any zamba like crimson zamba. Like it looks so nice until that orange color comes out. You know what I'm saying? Like, and then you're like, no, how do I even make a car like this? You know, like. But um, that's the one. Like the green looks really good because it's got the black and the green. You know, right. but and the orange pops so nice. But then the green and red comes out but that's just the, the, the thing with 20xx you know it's just unfortunate but i'm glad you picked apex wheels drop because i was gonna put apex wheels on this mm -hmm. and so it's kind of cool to see the comparison of the glow like like the lime green glows a lot okay which is great but it also costs i mean i haven't looked recently but maybe 20 plus keys what'd you say it was 22 keys for the lime apex okay so my my wheels are like one mm -hmm. <laughs> you know so we're going to go ahead and jump into it, though. Let me let me talk to you. Okay, so first off, let me say, this has the new matte paint finish on it, okay? Um, and I forgot to price that in there, but it has the new matte uh, pearlescent paint finish. And when I saw this thing, I didn't really like it until I started thinking about it, Jaw, and I realized it reminds me of a sunset. Because when you look at it, the colors diffuse so well. They blend so well. It's like you're looking at the sky on a sunrise or a sunset where you see all like this, like tons of colors painted in the sky at a varying mm. degree mm -hmm. all throughout. So with the matte pearlescent, what I thought was, well, let me pick some colors that remind me of a sun sunrise and a sunset. So here's your sunrise and here's okay. your sunset, right? Yeah, that's and interesting. Then, I had the other decal that you saw in the last car, the Circa Pro, mm -hmm. um, but because uh, I was doing this theme, I decided to actually go with the Storm Pro. And when I did that, the, the, I just like the colors just look so good um, because it kind of like if you look at it, the lightning kind of glows now, mm -hmm. right? So it almost looks like a th like a lightning storm, right? So this car is actually called Storm Chaser. So what mm -hmm. I did here, and again, I mentioned I was going to do the Apex wheels, but instead I did the turbine. But let me just get back to the beginning. So. We have the um, the Jaeger cars, 3.5 to 4.5, just like the last one. We have the Storm Warning decal, which is free with the car. Um, however, I have the pearlescent matte finish, and I don't know how much that is, maybe like a half key or something like that. It's very cheap. It's a rare item out of the new accelerator crate, so it can't be worth much. Um, and that's for the primary on both sides. So on this side, it's blue. On that side, it's orange, okay? 
For the secondary color, I actually use brushed metal jaw because what I was trying to do is make that pop out a little bit so it's not just blended fully into the paint, right? So when you turn the car around, the lightning kind of sticks out more than it would if it was a pearlescent matte. You know, it's more shocking, right? Um, so next up is the on the uh, orange car, I had the saffron turbines, which sounds weird, but the secondary color is um, saffron as well. And then on the blue car, I actually have uh, orange turbines because the secondary color is orange. So I'm, what I'm doing is matching those wheels. And if you look at the turbines, I'm gonna back out here again to show you Jawbreaker's car. This is my point. If you look at the turbines, this is one out of, I think, two wheels that actually like glow, glow, right? The apex and the turbine wheels. Uh, maybe the septums too? Yeah, septums glow pretty good. Okay. But you can see, like, if Jawbreaker's car wasn't sitting there, or if you're playing in game, the turbine wheels glow like crazy. Like, you can see them from very far out. But again, the point I was trying to make earlier is that for these wheels, they have two separate wheels, but for both wheels combined, it is um, four to six keys. So it's two to three keys for either wheel, which is way cheaper than any Apex you could buy. Even the standard one, I think, is like 2.5. Um, so you can get a painted turbine for that color and get that really nice glow which goes well with this pearlescent matte. Um, with the boost, I went with the, the obvious choice, uh, Orange Lightning. And I actually did that on both cars because it just goes very well and it saves a little bit of money. Um, and then I actually, this is the only car that I picked a trail jawbreaker. I picked the Hot Rocks, um, very rare trail. I don't know what that's worth again, maybe like a quarter of a key. So um, what I priced together was 8.5 keys that includes the car, the wheels and the lightning boost. Uh, the lightning boost was at one to 1 1.5. Um, and I didn't include the other two things. So you might be at nine, nine and a half. But for this entire car that glows and does everything else, it's under 10 keys, Jawbreaker. <laughs> nice. That's crazy, right? No, it I looks... think, yeah, I think people would appreciate that. I mean, I don't know. Did you think about going with the, the Voltaics? I did. And Honestly, the reason why I picked the turbines was again, going back to the glow aspect of it. Mm -hmm. Instead of going with the obvious theme, mm -hmm. what I did was I was trying to go with the sunset sunrise. So I wanted, when you see a sunset or a sunrise, you have this glow on the horizon, the source of the sun, right? So the wheels are at the bottom of the car. I wanted to show off the glow versus trying to just match my lightning. Not bad. All right. Yeah. A little thought so, into that. Is that a black Jaeger? No, it's just regular standard Jaeger, dude. Yeah, I'm looking at them side by side, and yours looks a little bit darker. I can't tell. <laughs> you can't tell. I think it's just you're looking at the contrast of the paint colors. Yeah, and stuff. maybe. You know, it's all <laughs> optical illusion. Anyways, guys, I know I talked a lot more on this one than I normally do, but I put a lot of thought in these cars, and I hope you appreciate them. I know John Bricker does as well. He yeah, spends man. like a whole two minutes to make his cars <laughs> <laughs> and wins almost every time. Natural. Uh, but anyways, guys, last time I remind you, this Car Wars is different. Make sure you go vote. Tell us which cars you like better, and then the loser will put a biomass up for free to the community on Twitter as soon as the vote's over. Anything to say before we go, man? Yeah, man. Good luck. May the best cars win. Yeah, you too. I can't wait to see the results, man, because I honestly have zero idea <laughs> who's going to win on this one. All right, guys. I hope you enjoy the show. We'll talk to you later. See you.